Alright, hi guys, welcome to the vlog, and this is going to be another sit down talking video. Um, yes, I'm still answering. This is a part two to me answering the questions on my fitness, and I realize that I still have more questions, and I don't want them to go unanswered. So I'm looking at my laptop, filming on my phone as usual, and um, uh, face beat by Ben says, "What's the cost for your waist trimmer?" Well, my um. It's called the Pomi Fitness Belt, and Pomi is the name of my company. I have Pomi Fitness, Pomi by Lyric, and we'll see what else is gonna come for 2019. Um, yeah, so it, if you go on Pomi Fitness on Instagram, you say the cost, but I believe the medium is well, having a sale now, and I believe it's 55 for the small, 65 for the medium, 75 for the large. I think so, or 56 to 70. I'm not sure, but we're having free shipping now on the website as well as the discount so um only one emperor miguel says morning moms aside from your belt you ever think of doing one four thighs or arms bunny just like the belt to sweat hmm i've never ever thought of that my mommy has one and i was like would i do this though but i've never i've never it came across my mind but i don't think i will be doing it but we'll see we'll see because your girl's struggling so we'll see um beauty underscore roses how do you stay motivated i try so hard but always lose the motivation to keep going <sighs> motivation comes and motivation goes and it's fine if you're demotivated use that time to focus on your nutrition if your nutrition is a struggle for you so if you don't want to go to the gym use that time to focus on your nutrition if you are going to the gym then focus on your nutrition again find something to fill that gap of you being demotivated because if you don't find something to fill that gap within you being demotivated you will make wrong decisions you will make decisions rather that you're going to regret now i've been looking at foods and foods that are healthy unhealthy good foods bad foods and there's so much literature out there that says different things there's so many videos that said different things but the only thing i would say that has always worked for most if not everybody is to listen to your body if your body is craving sugar go grab a fruit if your body is craving salt go grab some nuts you know what i mean like listen to your body let your body is craving and then google when my body is craving sugar what should I eat that is healthy? Or when my body is craving salt, what other he healthy options are there? Like Google that and you'll definitely find amazing things that you can eat. But whenever you're demotivated, use that time to focus on something else. Use that time to probably write how you're feeling and who knows, maybe new writing, you may become an author. You can start a, 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 a blog, um, fitness and motivation. I don't know. I mean, just just don't be bored because for me whenever i'm bored bad shit happens so don't be bored <laughs> um shell shelby the great says need routine when going to gym and advice so you need a routine and advice well i've done a lot of fitness videos here on my look on cut channel and it's when i was looking back for content to put into other videos that i can look and look for old videos I actually found some that I did like two years ago, some workout videos, and I found myself like wanting that body back, that slim body, because I'm like, oh my God, my arms are so much smaller back then. But it was also the time where I was, I had an unhealthy relationship with food, you know? So a part of that weight loss or whatever could be mostly attributed to me not eating. Um, What else? what's the and i've given advice already in going to the gym in part one so you can watch part one and then come to part two 19 candy kisses 81 says what's the best way to remove back fat and the kangaroo pouch well the kangaroo pouch um i would say back fat hit h-i-i-t research hit and research list l-i-s-s -S. so h-i-i-t is I don't know what hit means but list means low intense steady state cardio oh and hit means high intense interval training 
right so both of them are forms of cardio but one is fast with, with bursts of energy and how hit is done is whenever you're performing hit you go and it's balls to the wall as somebody says and you go you give your full 100 percent until you bust within that 20 or 30 seconds and then you rest or keep on doing the motion for another 20 or 30 or so this is just one steady walking one steady riding the bike one steady on the stairmaster no speeding up no slowing down just one steady state excuse me and of course eating you cannot out train a bad diet um your body type is i've been seeing a lot 80 percent e um eating 90 20 percent gym 90 percent eating 10 percent gym 70 percent eating 30 percent gym but it's always the food so be careful of what you eat and also research what i can eat for a flatter tummy what i can eat for bloating what i can eat for whatever whatever, whatever. just google because that's what i've been doing a lot when i'm stumped i just google um so mickey d says what exercises get rid of back fat and how often do you go to the gym what is your diet like in order to lose weight so i started this new program as i told you guys with um, ajazi and her workout program is six days a week and it's gym so six days a week in the gym for this week however i have not been going to the gym um i'm not going for the i went on monday and i'm not going tuesday to saturday and then i'm going to start back on monday now when i start back on monday i'm going to include all the workout that i didn't do for this trip now um i'm going to i'm going to do a video on that you know like how to get back on track or something like that so i'm going to do a video like that i really hope side note i really hope you guys aren't annoyed with me doing mostly fitness because i'm worried because i was critiqued for just doing fitness on here and i don't want you guys to feel like i'm ignoring you you know I tr i'm trying to add diversity to this channel hence the um the talk through get ready with me makeup look the other day um so i'm trying to diversify what i'm doing so i hope you guys can appreciate that but um yeah and what's your diet like um my diet is now getting better and i'm going to be doing more what i eat in a day video um videos so um so you see what my diet is like but um i I'm, it's getting better now. I had an unhealthy relationship with food. I used to be afraid to eat food. And I go through boats where I just eat whatever the crap I want. Especially when I'm on my period. When I'm on my period is when my cravings are at its worst. And it's almost... I almost can't manage it. Like, I just have to eat whatever I'm craving. And if I eat something else, I'm going to still crave what I'm craving. You know? So, yeah. Um, it is what it is. 28 says what kind of waist trainer do you recommend my very own oh waist trainer um from pooks's pooks's hair boutique studio they're on instagram i've already did a review i like the stuff and she's jamaican so i'd like to support her rennie boo ever bliss how do you control your cravings um it's difficult to control the craving especially when i'm on my period personally like as i say i have to eat what i'm craving but what helps is intermittent fasting because you eat later on in the day you have more room to play around with your calories your fats and your proteins so intermittent fasting i suggest um k fancy face mad k fancy madam says do you have pain in your insteps after a long workout if you do how do you ease it no i don't and i would recommend a massage or um maybe your form is off so watch videos on how to do like um good form in kettlebell swing or how to do a kettlebell swing so look on the forms and see if your form is off that may be contributing to the instep pain elena underscore scott says hi lyric i'm f i am i have been following you for a long time <coughs> excuse me and admire your efforts you put into your fitness journey did you lost did you lose any weight since you started lifting or did you lose any majority of weight with the cardio on the hill lost majority of the weight with cardio on the hill um but i had no muscle mass so i just lost weight and i was very jelloy um i wanted to start having 20 pounds of what i have to lose so was questioning if i should start with cardio with weights okay so i recommend doing a mixture do cardio as well as weights um and i would say time your cardio after your weights only because you have more strength i would say reserve your strength for the weight lifting and then you can do your cardio after but if you want to do a cardio before and you have strength in your weight lifting you can go ahead and do that or you can research because there's a lot of literature out there that would go against what i'm saying but i personally like to do my weights before cardio and that's because th that's what i've been researching and seeing and that's what that's what's been happening but if you have the strength to do your cardio um before if you have it, the strength to do your weights after your cardio now say so, you know you can do that um and again um my main recommendation um would the hit 
high intense interval training i'll be starting that on monday along with my program and also you can do hit training with weights as well um it's just uh, uh, it's just um the momentum and and um, the momentum not necessarily the weights but the momentum of course pick a weight that's challenging not not one that's easy so how many times you do it and your, your breaks in between so you can be hit with weights what that's what i've researched anyway um so amaya raymond says how do i grow my glutes i hands down recommend brett contrary's glute program he's the glute guy i don't know his program um i think last year and it has contributed to the majority of my glute growth i know with a jazzy i still like my glute shaping especially from from my side profile i still like my ass like shaping out so that's pretty cool and nutrition works as well because remember your glute there are muscles your glutes are muscles your ass muscles and they are comprised of three muscles the medius the minius and the gluteus the, the gluteus maximus so the medius maximus and medius so those three glute muscles are what you have so they're muscles so they need to be fed in order to grow just like your biceps wherever your calves they're all muscles that need to be fed in order to see growth so feed your muscles um uh, denise murdoch says i love to see john <laughs> queen tammy queen queen times six says i have to get that Tommy trainer oh, you should um yeah that's basically it oh i got through all the questions all right you guys thank you so much for watching this video i feel like i'm rushing because i'm not sure what the memory on my phone is like and i'm praying to god when i go up i can buy my camera i see it on best buy for like 400 and something dollars um i have to talk to jeremy and i, I really really need a camera because it's just easier when I have a camera, you know. I mean, editing is longer, but when I have a camera, I can have my phone and save the battery life on my phone. But yeah, so that's it for this video, guys. Thank you to everybody who asked questions. My head wrap is from Sweet King Jazzy Baptiste on Instagram. Thank you so much, you guys, for asking me questions. Thank you for even giving a shit. Thanks for caring, you know, to ask. And I'm just glad that I'm able to encourage people. You know, my mindset has completely shifted where my fitness journey is concerned. And it's 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 going to take a lot of getting used to, but I'm getting there. So, yeah, I'll talk to you guys in the next video. And bye, guys. <laughs> I'm so weird. Yeah, life will never make sense because you never made sure. We got it twisted, sick like a fever. Little man live, stack dough, keep up. Man up, get up out of that treehouse, leave them cookies alone. It's time to eat meat now. Trying to show you a new way to live now No charge, you call it a freestyle Without Christ, a normal man is You're born a man's body like Tom Hanks and Ben <laughs>